Hello and welcome to Fin Business. We are in midst of some very interesting conversations related to trust and experience. With me today is Mr. Hirin Pandya, who is the Chief Information Security Officer at Liberty Insurance. Hirin, welcome Hi. to Fin Business. Thank you. So, Hirin, uh, experience is one of the most important uh, aspects of your business, makes or breaks your business. How have you been? experiencing experience in the insurance sector today's customer experience it's more of mobile gone other days when we people used to you know walk into office for or the agent would you know touch base with somebody today customer wants to be on mobile he wants to buy a policy online he wants to register a claim online so being said online everything is mobile and having said mobile it's a big thing because our applications response times have to be beautiful the PIA information of a customer that's going to flow has to be in a controlled fashion and yet achieve a beautiful experience for a customer. So here the key is less of PIA information being transferred but delivering maximum services. So we ensure that okay not much of the data is going to get compromised or going to get leaked out somewhere in case of a eventuality. What is a trend in security, especially from an insurance business perspective? Everybody is now getting into that conscious mode of information and protection of information, whether it is business, whether it is custom, because both lead to something. Correct. So both the information are equally important for business, their strategies, their goals and the customer information. To build a customer bank for customer the services that are catered by and the information that is going to flow today we can say that customers are not that inclined like uh, the european countries or where the gdpr is but we are on the steps of almost approaching through that to the pdp and all so that awareness is now gradually growing even in the customer side so they would like to ensure that their information, their details are pretty secure. Now, insurance industry, if you speak, it's custom PI from motor or even from the health industry. So, but they have their, we have their information, which needs to be protected. And when we come to the gelling of it, we have, or we are trying to realign our own processes because security is people, processes and technology. Technology we do, people, awareness is very important. And that's where we try and reach out to the business, to the new joinees in the office and the IT guys. Make them aware of the latest trends and things. And the other aspect is around processes and the requirement of technology. So when we give this high level knowledge or the awareness sessions for the IT guys, they start building up things. Then comes the business side. So then what we I do is, get the processes aligned and the security requirements along with IT in the stage one. When I say stage one, it's like when we meet the business or when business comes up with a requirement, generally the BA understands the requirement, it defines something, it gives it to IT, IT develops a project plan. Now somewhere the security always gets compromised. compromised or like it's not even there somewhere in their project plan. So now what I've started doing is, okay, what information is going to be stored, captured and transmitted? The PI information. First part of the plans of information to understand what is the need of a business, where the customer PI or other PI information, whether it is from a business logic or business thing is coming up. Then converting that to technology that how they are going to control it and what will go to the customer. So build it grounds up basically. Grounds up. Fantastic. So properly aligning business goals and objectives and then getting security aligned to it. It's yeah. not security and business aligning to it, it's the other way around. Yeah. Business says I want this and we then start building security in and around that. So that gives them a good comfort that okay, I get what I want and then somewhere we have we do this, we have a buy-in from business. So right. technically I'm selling security to business to make them understand what is the importance, why we are doing this and some of the regulators. So you are selling security as a business accelerator. 
absolutely and when it comes to digital transformation there is a lot of existing technology stack which you are already using yeah. and there is a lot that you need to implement in the near future especially when it comes to transforming yourself digitally yeah. there may be a low overlap of many of these technologies so how do you plan to go about it so yeah since it's going to be a digital transformation the word itself says that it's a road map so somewhere we build something we move on we see the sustenance and then we gradually you know let go let go so we allow things to mature in a way we see how what is the control mechanism in and around it what is the risk acceptance and what is the risk exposure and then move on interesting that's a very gradual and a very methodical approach that you are trying yes. to approach for yeah. that thank you very much iren for this wonderful insights